This is John from That's My Entertainment, and I'm here with... Drew Roy. Um, now, this being the final season, uh, number five, um, a lot of shows have been ending at the fifth season, you know, to go out on top. Do you feel that this show is going out on top or ending before it gets a little... Ooh, that's a good one. You know, uh, when we first started, we were... We, we didn't know how long we were going to go. And I always felt like, man, if we can do five seasons, that that's pretty cool. Four would be good. Three would be a disappointment to me. But five always felt like was a good ending mark. And I think I stick with that. You know, uh, we could have, you know, kept it going for a couple more seasons. But I think it was a good time to wrap it up and really bring things together and bring it home strong. Um, now, I've heard uh, you've answered this question a few times already about the love triangle. Mm -hmm. I'd like to ask you the same thing. Lay it on me. So the the old love triangle, it's 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 cruising right along. It's um it's about to get shaken up though. So I think uh, we all were looking for something new to happen with it. <clears throat> and uh, I was just saying that it actually turns into a square for a little while. So if you thought the triangle was juicy, yeah. wait till we get in that square. Okay. But uh, how it gets moved from from uh, Maggie and Ben at one point, and uh, some some pretty wild things happen. It's it's the stuff that I'm most excited about for how this season. Uh, it's episode five and six, and I think seven. Um, and then at the same time, things are going on with Maggie back at camp that uh, Hal is completely, uh, it's unbeknownst to Hal what's going on. So when they get back together, we have a whole new palette to play with that, that, uh, that really changes things up. Well, thank you for your time. Yeah, of course. You have a good day. You too.